Okay, so in Australia in 2015, um, a kid named Cash right there, he died from a waterborne brain-eating parasite called Nigleria filaria, which is an emboda, emboda. and um, this happened because he was playing with a garden hose that was most likely contaminated with water, and it most likely got through his nose, which that's how that disease like gets inside of you. And then it happened really quick, so his parents brought him to the doctors, and he died about two days later. So this is waterborne diseases. Uh, what are they? Uh, waterborne diseases are caused by uh, drinking contaminated water. Uh, what type can they be? Uh, ambiosis, cholera, uridine, and E. coli infection. And then contaminated water can cause many types of diarrheal diseases, including cholera and other serious illnesses, such as gonorrhea, worm diseases, typhoid, and dysentery. Uh, the history, so the first like known outbreak was from 1986 to 1988. And 24 states and Puerto Rico reported 50 outbreaks of illnesses due to contaminated water. Uh, good hygiene practices can prevent the spread of waterborne diseases. And then it is said that hygiene has often been around at least as long as animals. And so um, about 432 million cases of waterborne diseases of people have been affected for like every year in the United, just in the United States. And um, so how to find it? So groundwater, it can be contaminated with like sewage, fertilizer, fuel, um, many others that just like leach, leach into it. And then ways you can find it are like if your water smells, has like an oil gas odor, um, bleach and chlorine odor, um, if it has like a metallic taste or a chemical taste. And if that does happen, you can call your local like water supplier to see if they can come test it to see if it is contaminated. And then um, illnesses, there is Gyarduria A, and it's a protozoan parasite, and some symptoms are diarrhea, nausea, and abdominal cramps. And then there's also Legunella, which is a bacterium, and symptoms are headaches, chills, cough, and a chest pain. Um, copper, which is just metal, and it's vomiting, abdominal pain, and there's you also get yellow skin. Um, there's hepatitis A, which is an infectious disease of liver, um, extreme tiredness, loss of appetite, and muscle aches, and E. coli, which is in a bacterium, and bloody diarrhea, stomach pains, and vomiting. And that's our sites.